Okay, so this is a tool that has two functions. It's a web interface that will import words and make an MD5 hash out of the words. And it has a second function to look up MD5 hashes, find a match, and give you back the word. So to see, and it, this is all stored in a database, um, and what I did to create this was create two controllers. So here's the first, and you can add a single word like the word password, and you can see here's its hash. Okay, but if you wanted a, to import a large data file like this one, you could upload it. Just hit submit. I've already imported this, so I'm not going to do it again. But what it does, it basically, I'll show the database here. So, in my local database, you can see it imported all these words from the word file, and here's all the MD5 hashes. So then, if we go back, well, let's just pick one of these. Let's take this word. If we were to go to the lookup, you just put in one of the hashes, hit submit, and it gives us the word back. So as long as you keep adding to the dictionary, you have the chance of finding more matches to words. Um, the code itself is pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Uh, this is the. Let's pull up uh, the controller here. So I have two functions. I have a submit to dictionary, which is submitting one word. It takes a word from a form as a parameter. And you can see I'm using Groovy here to basically do an MD5 hash on it. And then I'm storing it using GORM to these uh, two fields. And these two fields are this domain, uh, are in this domain, the hash and the word field of the dictionary domain. So I'm just calling dictionary and then just doing a save pretty easy. To upload a file, do the same thing through a form. I expect a hard return at the end of each line. I split on that and each word I pull in, I do the same thing. Except I have to do this. Um, take like the first word from the array because they come in like as though they're an array. And then I save them out. And that's pretty much it. That does the import. The actual lookup is pretty simple. I mean, it's just SQL. <clears throat> the form put in the MD hash, MD5 hash, and we're just doing a select the word from the dictionary table where the hash is the submitted hash from the form. And the pages are pretty simple. It's just GSP, real simple stuff. That's pretty much it. I mean, it's really a simple concept. Um, you know, in theory, you would test this. I could see usefulness for it. When I worked at one job, we didn't have a salted password in our database, so uh, we got in some issues with that. So you could run this over and over again on known passwords in the database and see in the test system and make sure that you never again have an unsalted. Uh, password because you know a developer may change his code, may revert back, or make changes to the salt salt that's going into the um, into the hash. So it could be a way of validating that 
The passwords are always uh, better secured than straight MD5 hashes. Um, that's about it.